probably not an easy way for me to hold this. Let me see if I can figure this out. What if I put it here? So this is a fig. Let me get some of this grass out of the way. This is a fig fruit. I'm standing by one of my fig trees. You basically cut it open. The inside should be very moist, wet with juice. When the fig is ripe, it will be very soft where your finger will leave an indentation if you squeeze it. That's how you tell when they're ripe. When they're juicy like this, they are honestly in their best readiness state. What I do, I just scoop it out with my teeth. Just like that. And we can go on to find the next one. These are still not ready yet. They're getting close. But like this one back here is ready. It actually has burst from all the rain we've got. And it's got bees on it too. So uh, the bees will definitely, when they burst like this, what happens is when you get a lot of rain and the fig will swell up and then explode and when that happens they're still edible but it will attract the bees which try to come and get the sugars I'm just gonna leave that laying there and let him keep eating on that there are others back here that have also burst open but I try to get to them before they get to that point and I probably stood here and ate eight or nine of them already. There are a lot more left to ripen yet on this one, one fig tree. But yeah, so I think I probably told a lot of people this story before. I basically went many years of my life not even knowing that I like figs because of a certain thing that has fig in the name that I didn't like. So based on that, I never ate figs most of my life. And uh, anyways, I got a fig tree when I placed an online order and I needed like $10 to get free shipping and figs were the cheapest thing to buy so I added a fig tree to my order in order to get free shipping and then when it come in I planted it really not knowing what to expect it's actually a fig that's over here this fig tree was my very first one which is funny that it is also the smallest out of all my fig trees <laughs> but anyways I planted that fig tree when I got it and it fruited the very first year it had three fruits on it and even though I didn't like figs I didn't want them to go to waste so I looked up how to tell when they were ripe and then when they were ripe I picked them and I was like you know I'm at least going to try it and oh my gosh, figs is now one of my top three favorite fruits. It's kind of like butterscotch, 
that somebody poured honey on with just a hint of a little nutty taste and so now I have like 10 fig trees on my property and uh, three different varieties they're really simple to grow too if you find somebody that's got a fig tree if you cut like a limb off that has at least two side branches like this and then plant it they'll just simply grow and uh that's how i got into figs and like i said now it's one of my top three favorite fruits and i'm just mad that i spent most of my life thinking i never liked figs and i'm just going to tell you why because of fig newtons <laughs> don't think a fig tastes anything like a fig newton because it does not so there we go. There's some homestead updates. Thanks for watching. God bless you. God bless your family. God bless your homesteads.